The Lamborghini Revuelto has finally been released and cars are running on public streets. So, you're watching Auto Anorak. Let's see some Lamborghinis. So here we have the brand new Lamborghini Urus Hybrid. This is really cool to see. Look at the front lights. They are a little bit different. The indicators we thought actually looked a little bit like a Tesla, which is kind of disappointing seeing this, uh, this design getting a little bit less aggressive. But look at this. So they didn't like having this test car out and they have distracted us pretty successfully with this anniversary Diablo 6 liter. It was a beautiful car. And then here is a Huracan Storato. This is the first one I got to see in the road. Pretty cool seeing how much higher they are in the road. And then of course, the Revuelto. This was an absolutely beautiful spec. This really light green, almost yellow color. And there's that 6O again. Hard not to love looking at that in the Italian sunshine. And yeah, they just had Urus's going about. Obviously the brand new Urus Performantes rolling around. This one was in a lovely, I think it's Viola Parsifal. And then that Revuelto rolling through. They had the green one and this black one. Looked like a test car. I don't know what they were testing. Varix has said maybe testing for a full electric one and then this was the first time a red one was ever seen i wish i posted this earlier and i had some weird stuff on it obviously hurricane technica that was another new lamborghini going around and here's just some footage to see like this was literally just in the middle of the italian countryside if you didn't know what the factory was you'd be pretty surprised to see all these hurricane technicas and uruses just driving about and yeah it was a constant flow of cars and if you know anything about car spotting in the motor valley you'll know about varix and we spent a lot of time with varix which was so so awesome on this trip and this guy listened to this car it made such a nice noise but yeah we're talking urus after urus and as that beautiful performante leaves us we have the storato back again beside some italian agriculture two lifted cars or vehicles driving through the italian countryside and yeah just a constant flow of lamborghinis it was so cool to be there and uh, the lamborghini staff weren't exactly happy about us being there that's why they actually closed the gate and locked themselves in with the uh Urus hybrid, which is kind of funny because they didn't want more cars coming through so that we could see them. But yeah, look at this Revuelto. Absolutely beautiful to see one of those on the road. And so special to be here at a time when there is a brand new V12 supercar from Lamborghini. I don't think that's going to happen ever again. And here's another view of the beautiful Revuelto. I just love the Y shape LED front running lights. They are so cool looking in this thing. And I love the spec on this Urus Performante really nice military green on it one thing i like to do when i spot special cars is take it with two cameras so you can see the car's details a little bit better with this video and there you go guys a day spotting at lamborghini it was pretty special don't forget to subscribe if you enjoyed that video and you want to see some more cool lamborghinis that i managed to spot from my trip in italy and also some really cool paganis anyway thank you so so much for watching this video and i'll see you in the next one Take care, guys.